Well, I'm down at uh, Jeff Fennick's gym in his house. Mate, it's great to uh, see you again. Ah, uh, mate, you've been one of my heroes for a long, long time. And now <laughs> mate, you're, even, you're even more of a hero because you're saving people's lives. And I think it's really important that um, this defibrillator is um, distributed to every gym in Australia. I think everybody should have it. If they don't, they're crazy. I mean, at the end of the day, you say, oh, $2,000 can save a life. Yeah, it's, it's damn worth it. Your, your, um, your story, I mean, Australia knows it the last... You know, a few months have been unbelievable. And then with the, the young fellow, the boxer, having the heart issue the other day and dying, it's just, it's just become a really, really strong pressing point with heart safety. What you've been saying in the media about just fortify your gyms, fortify the places you're boxing at, have a bit of awareness that uh, things can go wrong. I said, Leach, no disrespect, but I mean, the other day, I think we've earned 40, 50, 60,000 for the guy already. But for $2,000, we could have saved his life. Yeah. If, if we were alert early and we and, and we educate these people about this great machine, then um, we can save lives. That's what's that, that's I mean, there's a lot of boxing gyms around the country, and there's a lot of trainers out there that have people come in, and a lot of them aren't fit either. Oh. And and they're working out and boxing, as as you would know, is like your heart rate goes through the roof hitting the pads. And actually, the other thing is, a lot of these guys don't know. They they try to train everybody the same, whether you're a a skinny guy, whether you're a fat guy, whether you're a fit guy, whether you're on, they try to push these guys, mm. and you've got to really know the individual, and you've got, to, you've got to be really careful, and I mean, if you're not careful, you've got to have something to make sure that you, you, you can cover yourself with, and that's why I'm so happy that this is in my gym, it's in my boxing yeah. gym as well, down at Joe's gym, and uh, we're delighted to have it. Well, you um, you, you reached out to me um, a few months ago, because you had one of your young fellas training that you thought it might have been a heart attack, yeah. it wasn't, but you rang me up and said, Leachie. We need a deep you been here. Yeah, it was it, for me it was the scariest thing in my life. It's my it's my one of my best friend's sons and here he is taking a fit in front of me. I'm trying to give him CPR and waiting for the ambulance to get there and not really knowing what to do. Yeah. And um, you know, like I said, I have never been more frightened because um oh, well, I've I've never been put in that position and hopefully I'll never be put in it again. But if I am it's great to know that I've got the equipment that can that can help me now. We just spent a couple of minutes going through the deep feed that it's pretty easy to use, isn't it? Very much. It it tells yeah. you what to do. I mean, you can be <laughs> uh, as uneducated as me, you can yeah, just yeah. use this very, very easily. Oh. So, I mean, every, every gym should have it. Every house gym should have it. I mean, I think everybody in Australia should have one because you never know when somebody's going to take a heart attack. And I said, for $2,000, um, mm. it could be the greatest investment ever. Well, mate, we've been mates a long time. we followed each other's career, mate. It's great to be here. I'm proud to, to put a deep into your place and uh, protect you, mate. I've, we're, the whole of Australia was worried about you the last couple of months, mate. So, we're great. It's great to see you on your feet. and. Uh, May Jeff Fennick live for another 40 years, healthy so. and well, happy. I don't know about 40, but now, maybe 30. 30 would be great. Yeah, I, don't want to be, I don't want to be in the 90s and not being able yeah. to do things. But I'm like I said, um, I'm just happy to be here and I'm blessed yeah. to be here. And because I am here, I want to make sure that we, I can keep others and do what you're doing, Leach, and try to help the community and make it, make it safer. Well, you're doing that, mate, and it's a legacy that you're uh, passing on. Good on you, and you're doing great things. And, Thank mate, you. It's good seeing you again. Yep. One second. One second. Here we go. We don't want to walk around with these. There yeah, well, you're still looking good. I'm all right. We're both 55 and going strong. Well done, mate. Thank you, matey. Thank you so much.